Harvest Log, day 19 at Overbury. It's Saturday the 13th of August and uh, we are cutting the um, Daytona peas again. So we should get them finished off today. This is a field called Trouters. These peas were uh, zero tilled in after um, a radish cover crop mix um, planted uh, we've got stock drill about the last week of April, um, and they're all they're all standing quite nicely. The crop is um, is quite nice and thick. It's very dusty, very dry. We desiccated it about uh, about seven or eight days ago, um, and with the warm hot weather that we've had, they've gone off. Uh, they've gone off very very quickly indeed. Again, pea quality in this block um, is. I don't know whether you can see it in there. Well, maybe just in the shadows. Lovely, uh, lovely green, sort of bluey green pea colour. Um, so no, no issue on quality, um, and that, that'll de de depict what kind of price we get for these as well. That's what it's all about with the peas, getting that, getting that nice, nice clear colour. No yellow staining peas, and um, this is where this header uh, really comes into its own, picking up low crops. Um, you can see from down there. Uh, how short we're cutting it, we're right down on the deck um, and it's in its flotation flex mode which is, which is meaning that it's pivoting in three sections so we've got one there, the, uh, the section pivots the back there, the other section pivots in there and then we've got the third section out there as well um, so it's almost like having three sort of ten and a bit foot headers um, all combined in one larger one so fantastic job for this uh, combining the peas the weather's great they're coming in nice and dry we're about 16 and a half percent so we need to get them dried down between 15 and 16 um, which will uh, which we'll do just gradually now the uh, thing is with peas you don't want to dry them down too quickly so we've got some blowers that will just blow through the bins um, for these peas we'll take our time with that and try and do a bit of a cooling job um, as well um, when we get some um, some frostier, cooler cooler weather. So, yeah, here we are, last day of cutting peas today. We've got another three fields to do. Uh, and then later on today, we shall probably be cutting wheat up on the hill. Um, so we might get a harvest log day 19, part two later on. Um, and we can, have a look at, uh, we can have a look at that operation as well. So, yeah, quick look at the header, leaving the stubble. 